Rich. Yes. Do you want to play as Aston Villa? I'd rather eat my own fecal matter. Okay. Uh, do I play as Real Madrid instead then? Fuck off. <laughs> Hello and welcome to 60 Second uh, Game Podcast. I nearly muffed that up. You can tell you haven't done this before. Yeah. <laughs> it's for FIFA 10. And um, which is a football game. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> in the case end. You, in case you weren't aware. Um, and uh, well, yes, it's. Uh, oh, that was <laughs> off the post. With my player, no less. Yeah, they're doing. Uh, the loading screens, obviously, what are they like? It's just a training like, just a Training ground. arena. Yeah, go you can tell. It's actually that. called the arena. The oh, there you go. It's not a very big arena, is it? It seems more like a. It is just basically built for single player. It's like the back end of a football club. <coughs> That's pretty much the look they're going for. Mm, yes. Uh, yeah. yeah. Well, uh, the game is has been quite popular because it's introduced. Is it three sixty dribbling this year? Yes. Yes, you're going to have to help yeah. me out on this, for God's sake. Yes, it's 360 dribbling, and uh, the good thing about FIFA is you know what you're getting, really. Yeah. Uh, unlike Pro Evo, which has uh, sort of exploded. It's impl- imploded. Yeah. Imploded. Yeah, it's, it started yeah. off fantastically well uh, and has descended into not particularly good football games. Yeah, it's gone very arcadey. Yeah. I oh think. Whereas Bruce. FIFA has upped its game quite a lot. It's going for a more um, realistic, realistic approach. approach yeah. yeah. Jinx. Mm. No. <laughs> I think I'll be uh, sporting Guron. I'll be uh, <laughs> Malaga. Malaga. In their their purple uh, away or purple home kit. I think by the look of it. Uh, so anyway, yeah, we're, at the moment, me and Si are just doing a um, single uh, offline, not single, two-player offline game. Um, which is basically the same as our online games that we've played, but um, <laughs> we're actually in the same room to see you get annoyed. Yes, which will be quite amusing, I'm sure. Yeah. Rather than hearing it. Um, but um, yeah, the, the story's pretty... Well, there isn't really, so no, there is really one, no, it's just be yeah, a manager. It's, it's one of those, yeah. it's a typical sports game. Um, FIFA hasn't really changed too much. It's been gradual increases for about 10, 15 years, hasn't it? Yeah, it's... Um, since FIFA International Soccer on the Mega Drive. <laughs> back in the day. Yeah. We keep referring back to that of recent days, don't we? What, back in the day? Yeah, the, no, the good old good old Mega Drive. <laughs> yeah, well, back we've just day. reviewed two Except, Mega Drive games. Well, yeah. <laughs> so it's no wonder. One of which, most amusing, the other one, a damned classic. Random fact, mm. the player that has spawned for my Gijon team has joined Blues recently. Oh. Uh, Mr. Michel. That's that is that's just a nickname because obviously he's, his real name is not Michelle. It's Mr. Michelle. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's Mr. Michelle. <laughs> they call uh, me Mr. Michelle. Michelle, that's Mr. Michelle to you, boy. And what I will say about FIFA is Malaga are sponsored by their own tourist board. <laughs> yeah. What I will say is that that FIFA does look very nice, but the PlayStation version does suffer somewhat from uh, a stuttery frame rate. And I don't know if that's the same for say the Xbox version um, but the, especially on replays I've noticed when you score or get a, a replay the the game engine does seem to falter somewhat. it did that a lot on FIFA 09 as well but uh, I'm, I like a lot of the animations are quite good although as is often the case with FIFA you do get quite bored of them pretty quickly yeah <laughs> they, they do repeat themselves it's not as good as Italian 90 well, this is a completely different time I frame. I don't game. care. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if it's not Italian ninety and doesn't want anything. No, to do if with it's it. not that football game, I really couldn't give Actually, it a this monkey's is, testicle. This looks fantastic compared to Italian it ninety. Does. Yeah. Considering we've been playing Mega Drive games most of the day, it's um, it's a nice uh, nice push towards realism. Yes. Um, had a stab at goal there. Didn't work. You got. Was it, was it three, two sorts of modes of play? Is it on there? Well, yeah, there's more than that, really. But yeah, be, be could, a pro the, manager. The be a pro mode is uh, a, an oh, expansion nice on fist. the. Uh, oh, well, thank you. Expansion on last year's, <laughs> and I think 08's version of the be a pro game, um, whereby you start as a player, 
on your own team, either created or you can pick a pick a, a real a, player, a, a re, an existing player. I, you, I wonder uh, if they'd have a, a situation where, like, you know, it's like a rock back. How's that corner? I don't, don't recall that coming off me. Never mind. A uh, situation like Rock Band had where Courtney Love tried to sue them for uh, using uh, Kurt Cobain's face. <laughs> I think it was his likeness more than. Oh, uh, well. I don't know anything else, but that's well, He's not going to be look though. much like Kurt Cobain if they don't put the face on him. <laughs> no. Didn't sound like him a lot of the time. But anyway, um, I lost my train of thought. Sorry. Yeah, the beer pro mode, you obviously start off any club in the game, um, which in FIFA, as you'd expect, is almost every club yeah. on the planet. None of this uh, West Midlands FC. No, you do get the uh, the full kit and caboodle. Yeah, well, fully licensed, which is what what I've always liked about FIFA. It's uh, oh, it's always been uh, been nice to have like the proper licensed teams, the right yeah. kits. <coughs> Although saying that, your uh, Blues creation on Pro Evo Five was a masterpiece. It was. Um, that's where the edit mode. I spent days recreating not only Blues every Premier League team, but anyway, this is getting off topic yeah. again. Um, <laughs> The, mo the beer promo has obviously improved. Um, the one thing I don't like about it now that they've changed for this year, as opposed to 09, is the fact that um, you can uh, to earn to make your player get better, you have to play it on professional difficulty. Which, well, is that's not too much of an issue. It does make playing against some of the, you know, the bigger teams like Arsenal and Man U. Oh, <laughs> almost. Um, <laughs> And teams like that, it, it makes the game very, very difficult um, and quite demoralising because, um, you know, obviously they're programmed to be extremely good. And when you're playing as a team like Birmingham's, for example, which I am, well, which I do on my own, my version of FIFA, um, you know, you, you do suffer from a, a, a crippling lack of quality, uh, which, I, you know, I suppose that's fairly true to real life. Um, but still, you need to have some. You can take realism a step too far. That's, yeah, that's I mean, the what, issue. what you could do on the old FIFA is you just played the game, and however many goals or whatever, if you did a lot of things very well, you then you'd obviously improve upon it. Oh, there's a goal. This it's only a matter of time. nothing to me. And so yeah, and then once you've obviously created your player and done whatever it is, improved and whatnot, doing varying accomplishments, say scoring twenty laced shots or. Um, c completing 75% air passes, um, you know, lobbed passes rather. You can then, um, and you then improve your play that way. And you can pl uh, a nice touch actually saying about all these unimprovements over it. The big improvement is you can play your be a pro player in any game mode. Um, so, oh, oh. Um, you can then. <coughs> So me and Sai at the moment are playing just normal two versus you know, one on one. You can have your creative player in here, and he would theoretically earn the points and experience needed. You know, through that game rather mode. than playing it through uh, Bria Pro and all. Yeah, just yeah. constantly, which does get slightly irritating um, at times. But yeah, it's a nice touch and one that I would like to think football games in the future would uh, would follow. Um, oh, nice tackle. So yeah, I mean it's a good game. It it lacks a little bit of something sometimes, such as um, f constant free kick giving by the computer for no particular reason. Ah, uh, makes you try to chip. <laughs> yeah, it, some of the free kicks they they're very pro evo in uh, in the uh, severity of of being given. It's like you you accidentally caress the arm of the player next to you and uh, you've given away a free kick. Yeah, that sort of thing. But yeah, on the whole, it's the best football game out there at the moment. Um, Pro Evo has to up its game somewhat. Um, so I look forward to seeing what they can produce for 2011. But controls stands, are... Oh, the controls so. are much better, yeah. With the oh, it's three classic FIFA, but you can also choose the Pro Evo yeah, system as well. Can't yeah, you? which is what I'm playing with at the moment, because I find it's more natural. Um, but I'd probably be chagri uh, chagrined. No, is that the word? Ch ch chagrin. Chagrin. I'd, I'd be... Uh, Lambasted. I would be lambasted by hardcore FIFAs um, or FIFA players. <laughs> hardcore FIFAs. <laughs> for, that sounds for like uh, like a women's suggesting that, <laughs> <laughs> For suggesting that uh, this 
version of football <coughs> controls is uh, actually better. But anyway, that's by the by. It's the best football game out there at the moment. Well worthy of your time and effort into it. Um, so yeah. Yeah, I, 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 I can't really fault anything with FIFA. The, I mean, if. If you want uh, for the management side of it, if you want an in-depth management sim, then obviously you're going to play Football Manager. But yeah. uh, for something where you can, you know, you can like customize your uh, your teams, like make transfers and stuff, uh, without adjusting the actual squads in the game. Oh, you're giving me a free kick. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, there we go. A perfect yeah. example of the game really not making much sense when nah. it comes to free kick giving. Anyway. Uh, but yeah, it's um, if you want. As I say, if you want an in-depth football management game, then obviously you're going to go for a Pro Evo. But um, uh, football manager. Uh, sorry, yeah. Oh, I'm playing a game and I'm trying to talk at the same time. It's you're not muffing it up almost as much as I did yeah. the intro. But yeah, it's uh, football manager is obviously the way to go. But if you want to transfer your players, uh, I'm basically repeating myself from earlier. But if you want to transfer players <laughs> and enjoy the management side of it and play the games at the same time. Um, which you can't do in Football Manager, no. then uh, <clears throat> FIFA's probably uh, the best bet. Or, or failing that, you can get FIFA's uh, Football FIFA Soccer Manager as well. Yeah, which isn't very good. No. <coughs> but, uh, but there we go. Well, console owners will also be pleased to know that it's not just an exclusive. It's a uh, PS3. It's on all of them. Yes. It's on every, every yeah. console Everything. Ever. PS3, 360, PS2. EA PS... don't believe in exclusives. Oh, no. <laughs> Pus. Wii and DS you can get it on the full kit and caboodle and I bet uh, there's someone who'd be really sad that they owns every single console and buys it on every single one more than likely and goes oh there's a vast difference between each one. Oh yeah graphically <coughs> oh yeah the but DS yeah, and the PUS will be yeah. stupidly different as the DS is stuck in the, the PlayStation 1 era graphics yes. yeah and just to give an idea of how much games have improved over Football Italia uh, it's only 1 0 at the moment. Yeah. At half yes. time. Apart <laughs> from 16 0 or whatever. <laughs> yeah. I've had some good opportunities. You get uh, some, uh, it, it's basically trying to be match of the day or Sky Sports. Yeah. Uh, but in game form. Yes. So, yeah, it's, it's well worth your effort, <clears throat> especially if you're into football games. If you don't like football games. Or like, if you get annoyed easily. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm surprised I've actually kept my cool this long. Well, it's because you, you're playing against me and not <clears throat> the computer, I think. Yeah. Oh. oh. Indeed. So yeah, yeah. worth it. Worth right. It. Yes. Well, um, worth the. What, what did you give it again? I think I gave it a nine. Ah, right. Well, oh, worth given nine. your annoyances playing it the other other day, I'm quite surprised at that. Well, yes. it's, it's the only football game out there, really. Apart from it, no, I won't go back. To <laughs> apart from it, <Italian laughs> I won't go. I won't revert. Well, apart from all the games you could buy on retro. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. this is. Oh. Oh, hello. Camera went a bit. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it, it decided it wasn't going to follow me. I think it was thinking about giving a free kick, but it didn't. Mm. <clears throat> but yeah, um, 9 out of 10 is worthy of your, your time and effort. Mm. Um, you know, it's got virtually every team you can think of. Oh. <clears throat> so yeah, 9 out of 10, worth it. Get it. it. So it is. <clears throat> there you go. It's. Uh, uh, nine, nine out of ten. <laughs> How many times have we? I'm not good. Any good nine, at this? Nine out of ten. Yes, yeah, nine out of ten. Next two. time, let's have you introduce a game that you. That I know what I'm talking you about. You actually yeah. care about. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'll, 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 I'll do one to know about next time. So yes, adios and uh, say goodbye, everyone. Uh, bye. bye, everyone. Yes, to the pip. <laughs>